people, I'm ragged but right. We're harvesting artichokes today to sell at the farm store. Uh, we, the pep, pep band has come out to support us. You can hear them in the background. They're all about the occasion today. Uh, here I'm demonstrating improper harvesting techniques. I'll show you the better stuff when we go to Coachella. They're beneficial, so when you see these on your plants, you want these. These, on the other hand, are the cucumber beetle from the Coleoptera family Chrysomelidae. Uh, they're, they're not something that you want on your plants. I have had problems with these cucumber beetles in the past. So what I did to fix the problem, I threw some seven, you know? It, it's just seven. Just threw it on there. Uh, it took care of the problem, needless to say. Yeah. I had some commentators, but it did, did the trick. Okay. Well, they're back, but you know, now they're not so much a threat anymore. In the earlier stages, the, the artichoke plant was really small. So any of these beetles, when they're attacking it, you know, made a lot of damage to the amount of artichokes. Now the artichokes are big, you know, I don't worry about it anymore. It's not too much of a problem. If I start noticing a problem, then, then I'll address it. This has destroyed the plant from the inside out. There's an infestation now with you know, different insects, aphids, and then ants that are farming the aphids. I'm not sure if the insects caused this problem and transmitted a virus to the plant or if um, they're here because the plant is just in decline. However, my good friend and colleague, Pancho, uh, CSP, he, he told me that it was a virus, so I'm, I'm thinking that it's a virus. Big canopy has developed. 